Welcome to Log Furniture How To, the most all inclusive site on the net for log and rustic furniture, fixtures, and decor. That's logfurniturehowto.com. This morning on Pyramid Mountain Estates, just above Cascade, Colorado. They're already starting to clear some of this land off from the Waldo Canyon fire. Now I'm going to get over here into this pile of logs you see, start cutting me out some of these to take home and start running some tests to see how they start to dry out how fast we can use them and turn them into some cool stuff. got here was all green and growing trees, it's all ponderosa pine. All of the beetle kill that was up in here had previously been cut out prior to this fire. So thanks to my new friends from Rocky Mountain Materials, we got us a few of these loaded up. So I think we'll take a minute and go ahead and cut up a couple of these little ones too. Bring them down there with us.
us a few of these loaded up. Let's head on back down the hill. Get them over there to the yard and see what we can do with them. Well, we're back down here on the west side of Colorado Springs, just off the square in old Colorado City. We're here at the Stag's Lumber Yard. We're going to go ahead and get these things milled and see how fast we can dry them out. Appreciate you watching this video. Be sure to click subscribe and come on back next week. This has been Mitchell Dillman with LogFurnitureHowTo.com. We'll see you again next week.